Bananas are among the world's most popular fruit. However, many people seem to have their doubts about them because of their high sugar and carb content. So in this video, I'm looking at bananas in detail and what effects they can have on your health. Many different types of bananas exist, which causes the size and color to vary. A medium-sized banana, which is about 118 grams, contains the following nutrients. About 33% of the recommended dietary intake or RDI for vitamin B6, uh, between 8 and 14% of the RDI for vitamin C, magnesium, potassium, copper, and manganese, and just over 3 grams of fiber. And the medium-sized banana does come with about 105 calories. Now, over 90% of those calories come from carbs. Um, as the banana ripens, the starch in it turns into sugar. Now, for this reason, unripe or green bananas are high in starch and resistant starch, while ripe or, or yellow bananas contain mostly sugar. Um, all bananas contain very little protein or fat. Now that resistant starch found in green and unripe bananas is a type of indigestible carbohydrate that functions like fiber. Resistant starch has been linked to several health benefits, including increased feelings of fullness after meals, reduced insulin resistance, and subsequently lower blood sugar levels after meals. And it can also act as food for the friendly bacteria in our gut. So alongside the fiber content of bananas, you can see why particularly the uh, green or unripe bananas are considered very healthy. The fact that they increase fullness and reduce appetite is actually beneficial for weight loss, which is the opposite of what a lot of people have been saying. Do bananas have any negative health effects? Bananas don't seem to cause any serious issues. Although people who are allergic to latex may also be allergic to bananas. In fact, 30 to 50% of people who are allergic to latex are also sensitive to uh, some plant foods. The other common concern is for people with diabetes because ripe bananas uh, contain quite a high amount of starch and sugar. Opinions are mixed about it, however, they do rank low to medium on the glycemic index, which measures how foods affect the rise in blood sugar after a meal. Um, they score a 42 to 62 depending on their ripeness. Consuming moderate amounts of bananas should be safe for people with diabetes, but they may want to avoid eating large amounts of bananas that are fully ripe. Um, basically, one banana at a time is fine. Uh, probably don't want to be eating four or more bananas per day. Um, it's best to eat a variety of fruit anyways. Now, it should be noted that those with diabetes should always make sure to monitor their blood sugar levels carefully after eating foods rich in carbs and sugar. Overall, no surprises here. Bananas are very nutritious and may have several health benefits, particularly for digestive health because of their fiber and resistant starch, but also for heart health because they are quite a unique source of both potassium and magnesium, which are important for heart health. Just note, when they're really ripe, they are high in carbs and sugar, which uh, should be taken into consideration if you have diabetes or if you're following a, a low carb diet. But for everyone else, go for it. If you found this video useful, we'd really appreciate a thumbs up and make sure to subscribe to the Authority and Nutrition YouTube channel by clicking the big red button below this video, and then you can catch all our new videos uh, as they come out.